Whiskey Wonder Woman and in today's video we're going to be doing one of the single barrel picks from the Virginia single barrel release that they had over the weekend. So I got the Four Roses single barrel which I think out of the options this was the best one but it was also most, the most expensive one. Um, so this recipe which by the way because there are so many Virginia ABCs there was a bunch of different recipes in each store. So for the store I went to, the recipe is OESQ, which is 75% corn, 20% rye, and 5% malted barley. Here, specifically picked out for Virginia ABC. And the OESQ recipe is floral, rose petal, and acai, banana refreshing, and it has a medium body. That sounds pretty good. I don't think I've ever had that before. Since we had no water, and along with the recipe, with the result of extra aging, each barrel has about 160 bottles. So this is one of the 160. But technically, I think each ABC store had about less than 10 bottles of the Four Roses. So yeah, the drop was a little weak. Okay, so this came from Warehouse J, barrel number 66-5A. This is barrel number 40 of, barrel number 40. I, so I don't know how many barrels Virginia picked. However, this one is barrel number 40 and it's aged for 10 years, 10 months, which is pretty darn good for 100 bucks. The proof of this bottle is 125, which is pretty high. So we'll see how smooth it is. That is the bottle. Four Roses is so pretty. Their bottles are so pretty. I really do think that they're, they used to be underrated, but now they're getting a lot of respect now. So they're bumping up the prices on a lot of their bourbons. Okay. I've never had this recipe before, so I'm excited. There's the color at 125 proof. Looks really good. It's really deep and dark. 10 years old, 10 months. They should have just let it age to 11, called it even. Ooh, wow, this smells really good. I do get the roses. This is very floral. Oh my God. But I do get like deep, dark coffee notes and caramel mixed with the florals and the roses. A nice sweet vanilla. It smells really, really good. And it's so smooth. I don't smell any ethanol whatsoever. Let's go in for the taste. Cheers. Wow, that is so smooth. It just melted in my mouth. Wow. I don't even taste anything. There's like nothing left. It just like dissipated. The taste, it, it melts away so fast that I can't really tell what it is. I do get the oak. My tongue is really dry. And the finish is like, it kind of just like disappeared. It doesn't even burn whatsoever. It is extremely smooth. Probably one of the most smoothest bourbons I've ever had that is 125 proof. It's so smooth, I, I can't even tell what the tasting notes are. It says rose petal acai banana, banana. Let's see if I got banana. Hmm. 
I wouldn't say banana. I would probably say a bananas foster. Is that what it is? When it's kind of like cooked and caramelized in that sugar. Maybe that's what I'm getting. I wouldn't say it's straight banana, which thank God, because I don't like banana flavor stuff. I think the banana profile here is more of a sweet sugar caramelized fruit happening. It's just missing the ice cream at this point. This is pretty good. I would give it a thousand point score on the smoothness because it doesn't really burn at all. And if it did have a burn, it's from the proof. But because it's so smooth, I don't even realize the proof is so high. I will say the finish is a little dry. And maybe that's about it. But overall, this is probably one of the smoothest Four Roses single barrel bourbons that I've ever had. I've never had this recipe before. Um, O-E-S-Q. And remember, there's like 10 different types of recipes, so you don't know what you're going to get. Except if it's OBSK, oh my God, it's going to be spicy. <laughs> like my last video. I'm so glad it's not a spicy one. This one is way better. I enjoy it a lot. 10 years old, 10 months. I think this is an amazing pour. Yeah. That is flawless. Almost flawless has a great aroma, the taste is so smooth, melts away, does have that caramelized sugar happening. I won't say that I actually get banana flavor, I would say more of caramelized bananas like a dessert. And the finish, super smooth, a little bit dry, but that's okay, because now I'm ready for my next sip. That is my review on the Four Roses single barrel, barrel strength that was picked for Virginia ABC. And if you're from Virginia and you got one of these bottles, let me know what recipe you got and let me know how it tastes because I haven't tried all the recipes yet, but I wanna kind of figure out which one is my favorite. Because I've tried OBSK and now I've tried OESQ, I have two to go off of. So let me know which one I should get next. See you in the next video. Cheers.